Well, what's that then? Oh. Oh God, what's this? You gotta find something that fits there. Oh. That goes in there. Judge box. Oh, we gotta find out. I'm confused. Oh, it's got something to do with this, isn't it? Alright guys, so we gotta try and work out this puzzle now. The monkey thief. Uh, the judge read the sentence out loud in an unwaving voice. So the judge read, the judge being the monkey, he read the sentence out loud. Unwavering voice. Fingertips sliding rapidly over the small bumps that covered the surface of his paper. And so the cold blade and Emily fell into the innocent's neck. Um, I don't know. Uh, you have him on the hands, maybe. Got that one at the, the end. Obviously, he dies. What's here, though? How do I... There's no spot for this. Maybe this just leaves blank. So we have five pages, okay? So obviously each page represents uh, a judge. You know the fifth judge? Well, I'll write this down here. So we just have to try and work it out through there, I guess. He's headless. Blade took his neck off. So we put headless for that. Um, number one, I don't know. Uh, so number one is actually paid. Uh, I'm thinking small bumps, eyes, or years maybe. Could be years. Small bumps, but it covered the page, so years wouldn't be covering the page. So prob probably eyes. And right, let's go on page two. The defense attor attorney seemed hypnotized by the angry movements of the judge's lips. Or maybe you put him on his ears, so you don't have to hear him anymore. On the slip of paper that she lifted over her head in desperation. I don't know, hands on head or something? Or has it got one on head? Oh, we don't know this one. Uh, hands on eyes, small bumps. Small little bumps. Uh, oh, what was the other one? So we got this one and this one right, I think. Oh, I don't know. Oh, something about lips, the second one, wasn't it? Something about lips. What's this hammer thing here? That's... Oh, what the fuck? Ah, that's how you... Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, that was wrong. <laughs> what the... <laughs> Okay, we got we got two. Don't, don't I know two of them were right. I wasn't. He didn't want to like. So the second one, he didn't want to hear what the person was saying. Uh. I don't know. A hands on mouth, maybe. I can't remember the second. Well, no, the third one we didn't know. I put a question mark. I don't know. We haven't had the mouth one, so why not? I didn't understand this third one. That should be right, right? Yeah, yeah. What's that? Use staple gun. The power is adjustable. What's this for? Huh? Staple gun? What's that for? Ah, it's for the arm. Right, we need to go back there. Yeah, that one wasn't too bad. I, I couldn't work out the third one. It was a guess. Like, I'm going to be honest with you. I just... 
but sometimes you got to guess it. I'm sure the third one did make sense, but it just wasn't making sense in my my head. And the the first and the second one I got, and the the fifth one was quite easy, and obviously the fourth one you don't need to guess. Where's the mirror now? God, I get lost in this place. I get absolute lost. Was it B two, B one? Or... He's there, isn't he? Now we need to go in the other world now. To stay blink. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, we're doing bits right now. We're doing bits. I'm quite happy of where I've angled things. Uh, that one's locked. The judge one was really difficult. Probably the hardest one so far. Mm, the cash register one was hard as well. Oh yeah, pick this up. I was wondering where he went then. God, where your arm gone? Uh, okay, gotta click on him first. We staple this together, that's what I'm thinking. Oh, just look at that. Little staples, look. Staple gun isn't powerful enough. What? What do you mean it's not powerful enough? Oh? Huh? Uh, how about now? What's that do? Okay, I think I did it. At least you're not falling your arm off, you know? Keep your hands on, keep your hands on. What a great sound. We've still got one door left that we've not gone through. Hey, how's your arm going, mate? Father, are you okay? Just did a bit of surgery. Carolyn, my child. That thing has stolen my Bible. Oh, how terrible! Stay there, Father. Right now, it's vital that you keep calm. You've lost a lot of blood. How the hell are you still up? Yes, you're right. I don't know how I'll be able to thank you for taking care of my arm, my child. What are you talking about, Father? It wasn't me. But I saw you. Oh, uh, you are right. I'm getting confused. Now that I think about it, it was Dr. William who treated my arm. Dr. William, the Wildberger twin's father. Is he in the mansion? William. William. John William? Was John the granddad? Oh, I'm confused. I had no idea Dr. William had daughters. Where can I find him? You didn't? He's usually in his office. You'll probably find him there. Really? I'll go find him. He might be able to give me some answers. Wait, take this with you. I'm sure it'll be most useful to you than me. Thank you, Father. I'm sure this will be of help. God be with you, child. Electro electrical lamp with a power switch. Oh. Ah, yeah. Now we can get past. Can we use this? Huh? I don't know. We have to go in the other world now? With a power switch. Yeah, maybe we can um, use it in the mirror. That's what I was thinking. Do you want to go past that enemy at the uh, end of the corridor? And maybe other positions like the one downstairs as well. Because um, where there's no light, it's got to be right. What else would it be for? So, how do we use it? Yeah, he's down here. We couldn't turn the light on, remember? So... Uh... Examine? Or maybe it just automatically comes on. Oh, it does, yeah. We have, like, another area? Oh, I remember the area anyway. 
which was like this we can get past we can go there next time oh yeah baby and we still got another room as well which we didn't go to He's quite close. I don't know what it looks like. Blast him. With a shotgun. Where is he? Oh yeah, we're gonna lose health. Bugger losing more health. You dead already, yeah? Yeah, there's some people that are like running out of armor in this game. I don't understand this. There's plenty. What have you been doing? Aiming your shots too early or something? I don't know. God, what's this? Oh, we can get that gun now, can we? On the other side, maybe? That gun was looking at. Uh, oh no. Looks like there's nothing here. So this automatically comes on when, in, when we're in this mode. Unlocked. Okay. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. Huh? Or maybe because I've unlocked it now in this world, it'd be alright for the next world. Yeah. That's what I'm thinking. So, now that's unlocked. Okay, there. It's unlocked, yeah. I love this design, like, I love it. And now it's open. A homemade. Stabbing weapon, capable of releasing electrical charge. Ooh, lovely. Like electric gun. Minor injuries. Oh yes, I love that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, we can't open. I think that's it. I think we're done, you know. Seems like we've done everything we can. Stop moving. Stop fidgeting. God, I'll give you a Valium now. You don't shut up. <coughs> shut up. Um, um, yeah, what, oh no, we got a couple of areas now we can do because of the light, right? Yeah, let's get out of here, let's do the key. You probably say something, what you got to say for yourself? Where can I find Dr. Williams' office? You can find Dr. Williams' office on the second floor of the West Wing. Thank you, Father. Second floor, East Wing. I think we're on the West Wing. We west or east? I don't know. I think we've completed this area, this section. It's got to get out of here now. <laughs> Let's go to the east area. Through here, I think. Oh. Here we go. Past you without you hitting me. Yeah. Alright. This side. Oh. What was that? Oh, what the hell are you doing down there? I see you, you ass dragger. Stop dragging your ass. Look at him. The third crutch boy to you. I oh, haven't got anything for that. Could do a save in it. Is this the part? No, no, no. It's not. It's a bit downstairs where we need to go as well. Uh, but I think there's a door here that we've not opened. I think so, yeah. Dining room. We need to go to the dining room. Excuse me, do you know where the dining room is? What's that? We hear something. Something upstairs or what? Yeah, the dining room. He was eating his soup, right? There's a door here, I know where it is. 
Which way is it? Oh, the boobs. Good set, that. Fair play. Oh, hello, Arstraga. What are you doing in here? Yeah, you're guarding the door, you know. Yeah, you just topple over on your ass. Give you a couple of whacks for a good measure. In you having a couple of bit of food, you? Yeah, I bet you are. You're having a bit of grab. Right, we got another puzzle here. I don't know. I don't understand how this works. Oh God. Hmm. So you have two triangles on the top one. Is it like because like the bottom bit is? We're going from the bottom to the middle, and then we go upwards. So like, the bottom bit looks like a square. Then, you have like, this one. So the hexagon. I don't know. Try it. Nope. Maybe the other way around. I'm a little confused on this. It's taking me way too long. Uh, so would that be? Is it, have we got? Oh, because it got a little, no, a little point on the top. Why would have? Oh no. Uh, oh, point. Oh well, it's done, guys. Uh. Oh, I think you got to follow the shapes. I, I don't even know how to do that one, to be honest. That was a hard one. Oh, we got another a videotape. We're going to be going back again. Chapel. 94. Alright, that's like... What date is it on this game again? Oh. Ugh. Animal. What kind of animal? Right, I'm getting confused now again. I'm going to head back and uh, put this video cassette in. Alright, so we got a, a video cassette player again. VHS. Got to go back now and put this in. It always sounds like... I guess they're at the top of the stairs, right? And then, uh, yeah, that puzzle was a bit strange. I wasn't quite sure how I was doing it. Bit of a guesswork, really. With a vase. And now we have to... There's another point where we have to uh, go downstairs as well. Yeah, we... we meet... Oh my god, my, my uh, head is just gone now. So I'm going to probably end the session soon. We'll put this uh, cassette in now. We have to... Rip this out. Experimental. Is this going to lead somewhere else, yeah? Probably. We'll press play on it. I'm not prepared to go in there just yet. We're going to go downstairs. Have a little wander. Go to that other point. Then drop a save, I think. Because when they start struggling, it's time to come off. Like, I'm, I'm losing my way and all that. I can barely speak. Uh, we can just avoid this guy for now. We don't need to, uh... Oh, uh, hello! Mr. Crutch Dude. He's not a coat hanger. Oh, it's a drip. It's a drip, Pete. It's not a coat hanger. Oh my god. I'm just gonna leave you here. I like how they've repopulated the area like this. We could go a different way. Oh, we could go through the, the studio. Uh-oh. Okay, okay. But we're not getting this in time. I'm gonna use the electric thing for the boss. Uh, What, Pete? I'm gonna pick up the shotgun. Okay. That's annoying. You bastard. Let's all heal up. Let's see if I can plug the other guy. Dude. 
Sounds, sounds wrong. Are we doing alright for health and uh, stuff? Can we go this way to where I need to go? We might be able to. Just wanted to do a little bit more. Go to that room, see what's behind there. It seems like the next big area. Oh yeah, that was about the puzzle. That was a bit of a clue there. <gasps> Whoa, okay, okay. Ah, oh, dude. It's nice that you're here now. Christ above. One hit puts you on caution, though. Oh, what are you trying to do to me? I know you're here. Go this area as well. Upstairs the meeting room, we go to another dimension. <laughs> Sorry, big tongue dude. Alright, that's not a door. That's not a door. Sorry about the Yelps. Laundry. Or the linen room, as you American call it. The linen room. See, you do learn things from games. Uh, oh, Maria's diary. Another. And I mean, maybe identical twins, but their personalities are quite different. So we're a bit more extroverted. That's if we are, Anna. Her cold eyes froze my heart. I guess that twin was a bit... Uh, not so nice. Emma was the problem child, was she? It's definitely the laundry room. Jesus, that's bloody loud. It's as loud as mine. Now you turn it off. I'm trying to play a game here. Shut tight. What's in there? What's this? Awful smell. Maybe put some blood in there. Put some blood in there. Mix it up like a bit. Desperately want to use this blood now. Just tight, shut tight. Mm, okay. I guess I'm just... Need to find something there. Not blood. Might be in that. <laughs> Fuck face. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. Just relax. Just relax and play, Rebecca. Oh. God, they come at you so quick, though. You don't have time to get the shock, you know. We're in danger, we'll grab a med pack. You're doing no hit run, I'd recommend shotgun, I guess. Empty box with a uh, medallion. What's this then? It's like, uh, oh, a shape goes in here, like a W or something. Medallion shaped. Oh, what the hell's. Nothing else to do here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Combine. Let's go. Where the hell did you pop out from, huh? Scared the living jeebus out of me. What a load of baloney. Shower room? Shower room? Huh? Oh, God. It's fucking okay, okay. That creeped me out a little bit. Not too much. Uh, relieved. I just got achievement. A power charge can be used with your electric. Okay. My electric gun. Awful way to die. These poor bastards being drowned, have they? Oh, you got a shiny. Oh, I know. That's the MO disc. Seems like, uh, floppy. We know where that goes. 
Yeah, we, we're making progress. We've already got two stuck. Except for that vase puzzle, which I still don't know how to do. Tidy. I still didn't get that. The door unlocked. Service area. God, where the hell are we now? Oh, we're back here. Yeah, it's the same place. Did we explore all this now? I think so. I'm asking you a question. I don't know. Right, folks, I think that's going to be it for this session. Oh. Maybe not. Yeah, it is going to be this for this session. So, next up we'll be doing... Then we've got a floppy disk. We insert that into the computer. And we also got a, rev a film to go into as well. So that's what we'll be doing next time. Pretty good uh, session, I think. But a few. Something tore off one of the priest's arms. Yeah, that was yesterday's news. Thankfully, the doctor William surgically replaced it with a new one. Wasn't that us? I didn't even realize a procedure like that was possible. I also discovered that William is the father of the twins in the photo. Yeah, yeah, we got that much, William. I should go to his office to see if he can give me some useful information. <laughs> anyway, guys, see you next time. Bye.